Now we're going to start with our upper body resting and pick it up as we flow. But if you can take your left hand and put the palm of it right up against the front of your thigh, I want you to feel the sensation of you pressing them together. So that left leg and palm, push them pretty firmly into one another and use it to engage your leg nicely. Now I'm going to take my right hand and hold on to my other hip with it just so I can feel steady. Let your right leg go down as close to the mat as you can go without touching it and then pick it back up. Slowly going down and pick it back up. Let's lower it on an exhale and lift it on an inhale. And as I do this three more times, I'm trying to just keep aware of my pelvic placement on the mat. Pressing in the other leg for a to start too. I'm gonna lower that leg to like a two inch float. It doesn't have to be that low, but that's where I'm going. Circle your leg out to the side to come back up. And it's gotta be real slow. Circle it out to come back up. Last three. Very heavy senses down my left side or I'm gonna lift. One more time. Exhale it up. Good. Take a moment to bend your knees and give your hip flexors a second to recoup. And we'll do the exact same thing on the other side. Okay, both legs up. And right hand up against the right thigh. Left hand's holding my hip just to keep you in neutral. Press together the leg and the hand. Give them a good push. And lower your free leg left down to the floor. Back up. Lower it on an exhale. Lift it on an inhale. Blow it to the floor, inhale it up. And what I'm doing inside my own self is just pushing pretty firmly with the other leg each time the quad one falls. Now I'm gonna add the circle, circle it out to the side, come back up. I'm gonna exhale now as it rises. Inhale down, exhale as it rises. Last two, pushing into my other leg, I'm finding this just helpful. Same quick little break. You can then bend your knees and hold them in. All right, if you can place your feet down onto the mat, just not too close to you. So I'm gonna lift the top of my feet, standing on my heels, still bent but farther away. Let's take your hands back behind your head and release your fingers. Take a breath to begin. Exhale, chest lifts up above your shoulder blades. Back down onto the mat. Exhale, chest lifts up. So as we progress through these now like neck sequence, you practice lifting your head and neck on the floor as long as you can in good alignment. And then the rest of you can just do the leg stuff if you need a break. I'm gonna do one more. Exhale, I'm gonna come up. Now from this position, I'm gonna take my right leg, which is pretty far away and bent, and I'm gonna straighten it at the knee, which means that my heel comes off the floor. Pick it up high, bring it back down to where it goes. Pick it up high, down to where it was. We'll do three more. Exhale off that one leg. Now out of rotation. Next time you're like, could you turn in this direction on an exhale? Back to center, inhale. Turn in this direction. Center, and inhale. Three more. Up two. All right, introduce lifting that other leg. One, turn back to the center. Your straight leg is low, but it is lifted. Now you're going to take the other leg, lifting the foot, put the ankle underneath your calf, lift them both. Lower them both. Lift them both. Lower them both. Three more. Using an exhale, pick them up. Up two. Last one. Lower that foot, lower the other leg bent. Take a second and lower your head down. Good. Let's do the other side. <laughs> and then we will bridge. So from here, hands are gonna go back behind my head. We already did some intro lift, so if you can just pick it up one more time. Now I'm gonna take the other leg, switch so over your left, make it straight and low. And this is where I'm doing it from, picking it up and lowering it down. Now with flex heel position, just so that it matches my other foot that's on the mat. So lift back to the up lift, down low. Exhale up. I'm gonna turn towards it. Rotate wide elbows. Up, back. 
bring it back onto the mat. Outside of the mat. Onto the mat. I'm going to try to let my right side figure it out. All the things that that means. Two more times. Left leg moves outside and inside. It's going to go outside and stay outside. Kick out at your knee like you did on the mat. It's just going out to the side. And then tap the floor out to the side. Question yourself, is the left side of your body drooping? Or can we keep it up? Last one. One more. Bring your leg back onto the mat. Lift it straight, point it at the ankle. Pick your hips up higher, you're already fatigued. Take your heel up off of the mat and go down and up. Down and up. Three more. Reach and lift. And up. Two. And one. Heel goes down, body goes down. Take your knees, give yourself a hold. Good job. <laughs> Okay, adding a little combination to your hundred today. So if you can take your legs and then we'll roll up, uh, bring them to tabletop and then open them into a small frog position, not massively wide, but just like the width of your body. And then from here, you're gonna take your arms up into the air. Take them from here, reach them back a little further. Than that. And what I'm gonna ask you to do is bring your leg shape towards you and round your tailbone, up an inch or two, down. Little pelvic curl. With zero assistance from your arms, can you keep the energy down through the back of your head so it's not jerking off the floor? And what we'll do is come into hundreds from here. So you actually don't have to do all 100 at the same time. We'll do 20 instead. So one more time, let's rock up. Once my tailbone goes down, pick yourself up into 100 shapes, as low legs as you can. Let them shoot out low. Well. Inhale, two, three, four, five, and out. Two, three, four, five, and in. Two, three, four, five, and out. Two, three, four. Cross the arms. Reach the back behind your head. Bend your knees into that frog shape. Head goes down. Curl your pelvis. One, up, two, up, three. Five each time, by the way. <laughs> there we go. Legs go straight out. Arms straight out. Low leg. Inhale, two. Three, four, five, out. And in, two, three, four, five, and out. Two, three, four. Pause the pump, reach the arms up, knees into frog, head goes down in five times. We curl. Up and up. And two. And one. Shoot to 100. We go out and inhale. Two, three, four, five, out. Two, three, four, five, and in. Two, three, four, five, and out. Three, four, arms up, legs to frog, head to the mat, and curl up. One, two, and two. I actually am counting. We have two more sets of this to do. Two, and one. Legs go out long and low, arms to sides, and inhale. Two, three, four, five, and out. Two, three, four, five, and in. Two, three, four, five, and out. Two, three, four, left set, arms up, knees in, head down, and curl. And four. Three, two, and one. It's last time. Legs go out and reach and pump. Two, make them low. Make them low. Squeeze them straight. Heels together and five, four, three, two, one. Could you lower one leg to the mat? The other one follows. Flex your feet. Arms reach back. Take a long stretch. <sighs> Begin to roll up. Let's take a breath in. Begin as your arms come from behind your head. Reach out in front of your face. Lift your head and feel your side up. <laughs> Sometimes the first one don't get around your back. <laughs> Arms are back to your height. Curve your spine. Take a breath. Continue the curve on the way back. Use the leg work into the ground. Slow and steady. Arms behind your back. Take a breath in. Reach your forward, head comes up, neck, shoulders, everything below that. Continue the shape all the way up. Take our breath. Exhale, lower the wing all the way back. One more time, pull. Back in. Blow that air out. Always up. 
back behind your head, still be in the lean, spring all the way up. Now you get a second job. <laughs> other side. Good, you took it, I took it. Rotate to the other side. Let's hinge back, wide open chest. I have an angle for it, but take your back leg, place it onto the mat, finger spacing back. Hips you on straight up with your elbow, onto your back arm work. Lower your hips back down. Take your breath. Breathe like the bridge. Exhale your whole trip up. Inhale at the top. Exhale your whole trip down. Two more. Exhale. Push your back. I can't remember. And exhale back down. One more time. Chest, find some upper back extension. 